Hello viewers and welcome to recipe is your life. Today we are going to make a very famous recipe or you can even call it as a sweet food of Bombay that's now Mumbai. It's very filling. This recipe is ideal for the working people as it's easy to make healthy and yet very tasty. Rather this recipe was invented for the working people. Let's see how it is made. For making the bhaji for the pav bhaji, let's take a pressure cooker and to it add little oil. In this oil, add one cup of onions. Saute the onions for a minute or two, and then add half a teaspoon of ginger paste and half a teaspoon of garlic paste. Saute this again for a minute. Now add one and a half cup of diced potatoes. One cup of gobi cauliflower. Half a cup of carrot. Half a cup of mutton that is peas. Fresh or frozen peas. Half a cup of shimla milk, that's bell pepper or capsicum. Salt to taste, add salt to taste. Saute the vegetables for about 3 minutes. And then we will add about 2 cups of tomatoes you can roughly chop all the vegetables you need not to make any particular shape of the veggies to this now we will add about half to one teaspoon of chili powder as per your taste and half teaspoon of haldi that's turmeric Mix this up. Add to about 2 cups of water. Let's keep it to pressure cook. Meanwhile the bhaji is getting pressure cooked. We'll start the preparation for the pav. For this, let's cut the pav into half. Add some butter on the griddle. Sprinkle some pav bhaji masala on the butter. Now put the buns on it. and roast them in this butter till they are nice crispy golden the buns are nice golden brown in color they have nicely got roasted in butter and pav bhaji masala let's take a look to our bhaji now we pressure cook the bhaji for about 7 minutes let's take a look The veggies have become soft. Now we will take a crusher and crush all the vegetables. Let's put the heat on, on a low and start crushing the veggies. The, all the veggies have almost been crushed. To this now we will add about 2 tablespoons of sodi methi. Add about 1 tablespoon of lemon juice. 2 teaspoons of pav bhaji masala. The ingredients of the pav bhaji masala I have written in the description below. If you get the pav bhaji masala, good. If you don't get it, you can add these ingredients to the bhaji. Add finely chopped coriander leaves, about 1 tablespoon. Mix everything well. Let us give it the boil for about, about a minute and then put off the heat. 
this type of a consistency of the bhaji is fine garnish with onions and lemons and you can serve this recipe for the lunch do mean this you will definitely enjoy at least don't forget to give back your comments and do share subscribe or you can even hit the like button for this video thanks for watching see you in another cookery tutorial of recipes you like bye for now and keep healthy